Vicku and I am 9 years old and today I am here to give you the tips of the tallest statue in the world, the Statue of Unity which is in India. So I am going to give you 5 tips and one more tip. But first, I am going to give you a little intro about the Statue of Unity. So let's start with the video. So the introduction to the Statue of Unity is that it is an engineering marvel. It is in India and I am proud to say that it is the tallest, highest statue in the world. So I am so excited about this. This is the statue of Sardar Vallabhai Patel who was the first Indian Deputy Prime Minister of India. He helped in the unification of India. He played a very important role in the constitution of India. So he was a very 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 important leader. Meaning? Okay. So let's start with the tips. So the first tip is some more details about the Statue of Unity. Statue of Unity is huge, so huge. It's very, very huge. It is 240 meter tall, including 58 meter pedestal. It is thrice the size of the Statue of Liberty, including the pedestal. But so, if you want to see the viewing gallery, it is 135 meters high. It is nearly in between the chest and the stomach. And you can go up from the left. And the left part is quite exciting because I can't wait to see the view. I want to see the view. I want to see the view. It's like that. You feel like that. For me, I felt like that. So, watch the view, admire it, and click photos. So, the second tip is location and how to reach. So, I'm gonna do this tip into two parts location and how to reach. So, first, I'll tell you location. The Statue of Unity is in Gujarat. If you are in Gujarat, you must visit it. The nearest city is the Vadodara city and the nearest airport is Vadodara airport. From Vadodara, it takes 90 kilometers and less than 2 hours to reach. So the second part of the second tip is how to reach. You can reach the Statue of Unity with a taxi, bus or your own vehicle. So basically there is a parking lot and after a few kilometers the statue is there. But there is a point in this. The Statue of Unity is not visible from the parking lot. So you have to take a shuttle bus. So you park your car and then you take tickets and then you will see a shuttle bus and then you take that shuttle bus and then you can reach the statue in the shuttle bus and then you can roam around. So the third tip is types of tickets. So the first ticket is the most basic ticket which costs for 150 rupees which is nearly 2 dollars. In this most basic ticket, you can see everything for free but you cannot go till the viewing gallery. You can only come to the pedestal and you can click photos there. From everywhere, I mean the Sardar Sarovar Dam, the Valley of Flowers, the statue and the food court. The second ticket is, it is also type of this ticket and but it costs for 350 rupees. You can go to the viewing gallery and you can do everything in that. But sometimes you have to wait in queues. The third type of ticket is express ticket. We were six people and we took the express ticket and you don't have to wait in queues for that and it goes for thousand rupees. But it is very nice because you don't have to wait in queues and you can go everywhere. So the fourth tip is things to see around. So the first thing that you can see is museum. The museum is about Sardar Vallabhai Patel, the things he did for our country and they show even a short documentary film there. Are excellent. Left with an uncanny foresight and a clear vision for a free, strong and united India. So the second thing that, that you can do is the valley of flowers. So in the valley of flowers, it, it doesn't have a lot of flowers there. But still you can say it will develop and become the valley of flowers someday. The third 
सरदार सरोवर डैम वी सॉ दिस सरदार सरोवर डैम बट इट देर वॉज एंड मच वॉटर एट द डैम्स द फोर्थ इज द लाइट एंड साउंड शो इट हैपन्स नियरली आफ्टर टू आवर्स आफ्टर क्लोजिंग ऑफ द स्टैचूज ऑफ द स्टैचू क्लोज एट फाइव पी एम एंड द साउंड एंड लाइट शो इज एट सिक्स फोर्टी फाइव पी एम टिल सेवन फिफ्टीन पी एम सो यू कैन वॉच इट बट वी डिट एंड वॉच इट बिकॉज वी कूडन वेट द फिफ्थ थिंग एंड द लास्ट इज अ चॉपर राइड इट रफली कॉस्ट थ्री थाउजेंड पर पर्सन एंड वी डिट डू इट द लास्ट बट नॉट द लीज टिप द फिफ्थ टिप अमेनिटीज so there are three amenities the first amenity is the food court there are two food courts one is near the valley of flowers and the second is near the statue i prefer the big one which is near the statue of unity and we had there you can have doklas tea samosas and subway and there are other options as well so the one which is near the valley of flowers it doesn't have much options the second amenity is public conveniences the washrooms are everywhere but you have to wait in long queues for that the third amenity is free lockers you can keep your small bags or big bags in the lockers so it is for free okay so now i'm going to tell you the bonus tip because it is my favorite part so the bonus tip is the 30 rupees ticket so the 30 rupees ticket is for the shuttle bus so you take that ticket you can go everywhere leaving the pedestal and the statue and you can get a good view of the statue from the outside so click pictures like share comment and subscribe to my channel you will see a subscribe icon down here somewhere click that and you will be the subscriber of my channel if you are subscribed you will see a bell icon down here click that and you will get the notification whenever my next video comes bye cut cut cut